chosen one, this is a message sent to you. There is someone out there frustrated because they can't hurt you anymore. They're desperate for any reaction from you, but you remain unbothered. What you may not know is that there is implications that come with this. It's important for you to be aware of them. Sadly, it's common for chosen ones to be hated for no reason. This hatred often comes from people's insecurities, jealousy, or envy. When you stand out, you become a target for those who feel threatened by your uniqueness. They might not understand why you are different, but their response is to lash out. This is a crucial part of every chosen one's life. People with insecurities might project their feelings onto you. They see qualities in you that they wish they had, and instead of admiring or learning from you, they choose to hate. This is because your strengths highlight their weaknesses, making them uncomfortable. They react negatively because they don't know how to deal with their own feelings. Jealousy is another reason chosen ones face hate. When others see your success or happiness, they might feel that they deserve it instead. This feeling can turn into envy, causing them to resent you. They see your achievements and think about their own failures, leading to feelings of bitterness. Instead of working on improving themselves, they focus on bringing you down. This hate and negativity can be overwhelming. It can make you feel mentally exhausted and question why you are facing such hostility when you haven't done anything wrong. But worry not. If you're a chosen one facing negativity and attempts to provoke you, remember that your indifference is your power. Staying grounded and focused is crucial. When others try to upset you, do not let them control your emotional responses. Your calmness in these situations is what sets you apart and shows your strength. When someone directs negativity toward you, it's easy to feel overwhelmed or angry. However, reacting to their provocations only gives them the satisfaction they seek. Instead, practice staying calm and composed. This doesn't mean ignoring the situation completely, but rather not letting it disturb your inner peace. By maintaining a steady and calm demeanor, you show that you are in control of your emotions. Your indifference can be a powerful tool. When you don't react to negative behavior, it can diffuse the situation. The person trying to provoke you often seeks a reaction to validate their actions. When they don't get it, they may become confused or frustrated, which can lead to them giving up. This shows that you are strong and unshakable, even in the face of adversity. It's important to stay focused on your goals and values. Negative attention can be distracting and can pull you away from what truly matters. By keeping your eyes on your path and not getting sidetracked by others' attempts to bring you down, you maintain your direction and purpose. This focus helps you grow and achieve your goals without unnecessary setbacks. When people are hating you, it's important to trust in the universe. You should simply keep standing your ground and stay calm and indifferent. Trust that the universe is balanced and follows the laws of karma and divine retribution. Those who spread negativity and hate will receive fair judgment from the universe in due time. Trusting in the universe means having faith that everything happens for a reason and that there is a greater plan at work. It involves believing that the universe is inherently just and that everyone will face the consequences of their actions, good or bad. This belief can provide comfort and strength when you are dealing with hate and negativity. When faced with hostility, it's crucial to remain grounded and composed. Standing your ground means holding firm to your values and beliefs, regardless of what others say or do. Staying calm and indifferent to the negativity around you 
demonstrates your strength and resilience. It shows that you are not easily shaken or influenced by others' attempts to bring you down. The concept of karma is central to this trust. Karma is the idea that every action has a consequence. Positive actions lead to positive outcomes, while negative actions lead to negative outcomes. When people direct hate toward you, they are generating negative karma for themselves. Trust that the universe will handle their actions appropriately and they will eventually face the repercussions of their negativity. Divine retribution is another aspect of this universal balance. It suggests that there is a higher power that ensures justice is served. Those who harm or hate others will be judged fairly by this higher power. This belief can help you stay focused on your own path, knowing that justice will prevail in the end. By trusting in the universe, you free yourself from the burden of seeking revenge or trying to prove yourself to others. You understand that it is not your responsibility to correct or punish those who wrong you. Instead, you can focus on your growth and well-being, leaving the judgment and retribution to the universe. Enemies of chosen ones often become even more aggressive when they don't receive the attention they crave. They might escalate their negative behavior in an attempt to force a reaction, but the chosen one's calm and composed demeanor only serves to frustrate them further. This dynamic is common because those who thrive on creating drama and conflict rely on provoking reactions from others. When you don't react to their attempts to provoke you, it can be very confusing and upsetting for them. They expect you to respond with anger, frustration, or sadness. When you remain indifferent, it disrupts their expectations and makes them feel powerless. This can lead to increased efforts to get a reaction from you as they become desperate to regain a sense of control or validation. This escalation of negative behavior is a sign of their frustration. They may try harder to push your buttons, hoping to break through your calm exterior. It is important to recognize this pattern and not fall into their trap. By staying composed and not giving them the reaction they seek, you maintain your power and control over the situation. Their increased aggression is a reflection of their inner turmoil. They are not used to being ignored and feel threatened by your indifference. This can cause them to act out even more, but it is crucial to remain steadfast in your approach. Your ability to stay calm under pressure highlights their instability and can eventually lead to them giving up. Even while standing your ground against the hateful attempts thrown against you, there's still implications. This is something that can still mentally affect you, but you can't let that happen. Maintaining calmness despite attempts to provoke you is a vital skill for chosen ones. When faced with adversity, your composed response can baffle others and uphold your inner peace in the face of turmoil. This serenity is not just about staying quiet, but involves actively choosing to remain unaffected by external chaos. It's a sign of inner strength and resilience. When people try to upset or anger you, their goal is often to disrupt your peace. They may use harsh words, criticism, or other negative tactics to provoke a reaction. By staying calm, you show that their efforts are in vain. Your composed demeanor sends a clear message that you are in control of your emotions and not easily swayed by negativity. This can be incredibly frustrating for those trying to disturb you as it demonstrates their inability to affect you. Your calmness amidst adversity is a powerful statement of self-control. It shows that you are not only aware of your emotions, but also capable of managing them effectively. This self-management is crucial for maintaining your focus 
and achieving your goals. When you are calm, you can think more clearly, make better decisions, and respond to challenges in a more effective way. This clarity is essential for navigating the complexities of life as a chosen one. Remaining composed also helps protect your mental and emotional well-being. Constantly reacting to negativity can be exhausting and detrimental to your happiness. By choosing serenity, you conserve your energy for positive and productive pursuits. This way, you are not wasting time and effort on things that do not contribute to your growth and well-being. Despite all the challenges that come with your authenticity, you must embrace it. Embracing your authenticity means owning your brilliance without reservation. It involves navigating life confidently and authentically, ignoring distractions and staying focused on your path. For chosen ones, this is essential as it reflects your true self and purpose, unaffected by external negativity. Owning your brilliance means recognizing and accepting your unique qualities and strengths. It requires acknowledging your talents and abilities without downplaying them due to fear of judgment or jealousy from others. By fully embracing who you are, you shine brightly and inspire others to do the same. This self-acceptance is a powerful tool that allows you to stand tall and confident in your truth. Navigating life confidently means moving forward with assurance in your decisions and actions. When you embrace your authenticity, you trust your instincts and follow your own path, regardless of what others may think or say. This confidence is rooted in a deep understanding of yourself and your purpose. It allows you to make choices that align with your true self, leading to a more fulfilling and purposeful life. Authenticity also involves staying true to your values and beliefs. It's about living in a way that reflects your inner truth, even when it's challenging. This steadfastness in your principles helps you navigate the ups and downs of life with integrity and grace. When you are authentic, you are not swayed by external pressures or opinions, and you remain focused on what truly matters to you. The ability of chosen ones to stay focused on their divine purpose and ignore distractions is a source of immense strength. This focus allows them to continue their spiritual journey without being derailed by external negativity. Maintaining this focus is essential because it ensures that their energy is directed toward growth and fulfillment. Staying focused means having a clear understanding of your goals and priorities. It involves knowing what you want to achieve and being committed to pursuing it. This clarity helps you make decisions that align with your purpose and avoid activities that do not contribute to your growth. By keeping your eyes on your goals, you ensure that your actions are purposeful and effective. Ignoring distractions is crucial for maintaining this focus. In life, many things can divert your attention and energy away from your path. Negative influences, unnecessary drama, and unproductive tasks can all act as distractions. By identifying these distractions and choosing to ignore them, you protect your time and energy for what truly matters. This disciplined approach helps you stay on track and make consistent progress toward your goals. The strength of staying focused also lies in your ability to remain resilient in the face of challenges. Life is full of obstacles and setbacks, but staying focused means not allowing these difficulties to deter you from your path. It involves viewing challenges as opportunities for growth and learning, rather than as reasons to give up. This resilience is a key component of your strength as a chosen one, enabling you to overcome adversity and continue moving forward.
If you're still watching, I'd like to thank you for your attention. If you enjoyed the content and want to see more, please consider clicking the subscribe button. Your support is very appreciated. Feel free to share your experiences or thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, take care and subscribe for more insightful content.